Welcome to Electro Online. There are two kinds of principles. There are definitions, which we saw in the previous video, and then we have what we call assumptions. What are assumptions? Assumptions are something we need before we can prove anything. We need to assume a few things, some things that seem very self-evident, and so we're going to call them assumptions. We must begin with that initial set, because without it, we cannot begin to prove anything. If we doubt everything and we cannot make any one assumption, you cannot start proving anything. Now, assumptions fall into two categories. There are two types of assumptions. There are axioms and there are postulates. Now, axioms, an axiom is an assumption, remember, an axiom is an assumption applicable to mathematics in general. So something in your algebra class that you might have seen would be called an axiom. For example, if equals are added to equals, the sums are equal. In other words, if we know that A equals B, so A and B are equals, and then we add equals, we add C, and of course C equals C, so when we add equals to equals, the sum of the two must be equal to one another. That is an assumption. We accept that. We don't need to prove it. We go with it. Postulates are also assumptions. Just like axioms, postulates are assumptions, but postulates are used applicable to a particular branch of mathematics, and in this case, of course, to geometry. Postulate is something you see a lot in geometry, but it's the word used when we have assumptions that are for a particular branch of mathematics. As an example, a straight line is the shortest link between two points. We have any two points, the shortest way to get from one point to another point is a straight line. That's what we call a postulate. We accept it. We don't need to prove it. We can use that assumption, that postulate, in proofs as we try to prove other theorems. So these are examples of what we call assumptions. Axioms for mathematics in general, postulates for a particular branch of mathematics, and in this case, specifically to geometry. That's how it works.